back and that's Ekudayo by T.Y. Bello and that actually came out of first directed musical video. But before we go on, let me open the phone lines. You guys can actually call in now and the number to call us come up on your screen like very soon. You guys can actually call in. If you have any questions for Kemi or you want to say hi to me or you want to say hi to anybody in Hanging Out, okay, just call in. And then you can tweet at us at Hanging Out 5, Hanging Out Normal Spelling Numeric 5. Okay, and if you're not getting through to the number that is on your screen, you know, you can always send text messages. I promise i read them out. Okay, so the question, you can answer them. Oh, Lord. Is math involved? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Okay, so the question I asked you before we went on, you really hate math that much? Yes, I do. That's wow. why I study law. <laughs> I'm sad, I'm sad, I'm sad. I wasn't a fan of math either, but, you know, we just had to pass it. <laughs> hey. At least you passed it. Yeah, I'm just I did. kidding. <laughs> yeah, I did. I did with so much prayer. I know the funniest thing. Throughout my OBJ, I did guesswork. Throughout your objectives, you, yeah, you just OBG. did guess like Yeah, so, I'm like, like, may the grace of the Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Bah! And when <laughs> amen drops, that's the answer. Oh, oh really? Hey. So you're like, you need mini money more than yeah, uh, I, gotcha. I just did my theory. I should have tried that. And I passed. You know, that maybe that's why I failed. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Stay okay. in school, do math. <laughs> okay, so um, when were you able, okay, what time did you go like, okay, hey, I can host the program. I think I can. How did you discover that part of you? Hmm, I can host a pro program. I think I can. Mm, that is so weird. I'm trying to actually remember my first presenting gig. So <laughs> maybe I'd be able to, 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 to go into that space again. I know I was doing a lot of things for the arm of the radio station I was working with at the time. So, I mean, they kind of eased me into it. And, and then, um, of course, the big one was the Mnet Studio 53. And... I, I, I never I don't think I ever thought like oh yes I can do it it's I think it's more other people saying I think you should yeah. you have a personality <laughs> you speak well you know like you should do it and I'm like really I don't know I'm kind of shy <laughs> but um so it I, honestly like my whole career and everything that's happened in it I'm absolutely grateful to God because I I never it, it wasn't one of those things that were, that was planned. I've always been this type of way, and things have just been put in place, for essentially, for me, exactly. So, yeah, good times. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so is there anything about you that you feel that, oh, this is why people actually love me more? Is there something you do or something about you that you no, feel? I'm asking you the hard questions. You're, you're trying to play me to, like, an egomaniac or something. It's like, I think they like me because I'm pretty. Nah, <laughs> it's not me. <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm just I'm, doing my job. I hope, I mean, what it is I hope is I hope people are able to, to, to see my personality, to see that I'm genuine. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, to see that I'm hardworking, hopefully, you know. So there's, I mean, those are the things you hope people get when you, and, it, and whenever you open your mouth or whenever they see your work. You know, so, and then, of course, skill involved. You know, you want people to see that. You want people to see you're intelligent, but then you just never know how, what anyone is taking from it. So, yeah, so yeah. you're just being yourself. Basically. I'm just being myself and hoping that works. We can see pictures of you. Look how pretty you are. Where is that? Um, that's in Paris. That was for, uh, that was take, those are pictures. <laughs> I, that was in Paris. That was for uh, more attention. Dans. I went, um, they invited me over. Uh, to to visit their their, their 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 winery and things like that. That was actually pretty pretty fun. It was three fun days. That's a picture. It was just a, this are promo pictures. They were taken by my brother actually. <laughs> oh. Yeah, he's like a great photographer, and that's for a magazine. Oh, okay. That's my brother again. He took those photos. So oh. maybe that's why they think I'm a model. Because <laughs> <laughs> you really have. That's Ty Bello. Ty Bello took the other one before this one. So. Um, they think you're a model because you really have pictures. It's pretty odd feet. seeing myself on television and, and posing and like. <laughs> <laughs> like, so what are your most memorable moments on when while you were hosting? Um, while you were still in, memorable. you're still in the hosting business, but yes. when you were really really into it. Um. Hmm. Probably. Okay, because I try to be professional, and you, 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 you want to show that you are part of the proceedings, but you don't want to show too much emotion. And I remember one time it was for Maltina Dancehall, and it was 
a contestant that everyone had grown to love he wasn't exactly the best dancer but people just loved his personality he just spoke to people on screen you know yeah. and everyone fell in love with him and everyone really wanted him to do well and I remember when I had to say that he was leaving he kept on being in the bottom three and he just he'd come back and then he would he'd do something fantastic and he would make it back into the house and I remember I had to say that he was leaving one evening and I just choked up like so it was just like I could I I literally choked up and then I was trying to stop myself from crying and then I had to excuse myself and go back so I was embarrassed because you shouldn't do that and yeah, then sure. but it was just and then I remember the director Vinny was like that was fantastic it just, <laughs> I went, no it wasn't you know and it was just I just felt I felt how much he wanted it and it's even just thinking about it makes me slightly emotional but it was that was probably something that stands out for me if I had to pick something real quick you know but um yeah that's like most memorable yeah yeah I remember that <laughs> I know it's most memorable <laughs> okay so now let's go to the aspect of you being a, um, a, a video director okay. slash cinematographer mm -hmm. so what prompted you to like okay this is what I want because I know you went to film school mm -hmm. after so what like prompted you what? to go into it yeah um, I've always been intrigued by cameras so even when I was in front of the camera if they send me on a shoot or something and I'll be like asking the director, so what the sorry the um, the camera by so what kind of kind of cameras and you'd be like HD HDV HD. I was like, what does that mean it just it didn't make any sense to me but um, I was just always intrigued and um, uh, the last year before I went to film school I was doing a lot of traveling for work so for hosting and you know I was, today I'd be in Mozambique tomorrow I'd be in this place and the other day I'd be in that place and it was exhausting and I was living on a plane <laughs> and in hotels and I was just exhausted and I, I felt like I needed a, some time off or a year off or something and just being the kind of person that I, I am I said why not learn um, a new skill while I'm taking time off and because I mean you think about being in front of the camera there's just so many things involved you have to look pretty you have to speak well you have to yeah. and then you never know how long it's gonna last i you know you never know i'm i'm getting older you know so <laughs> it's like i don't know you know when this uh when this train stops so um i just wanted to to to, to add an additional skill with, that would help me have longevity in the game even if you're 50 you know you can still Ex i can always still you yeah. know <laughs> throw myself behind the camera and do great work hopefully yeah. <laughs> that was what actually prompted your thing yeah okay so from that was like what year when you went to film school to not late 2006 very like breakneck into uh, 2007 okay so that was like early 2007 yes so let's say you finished like 2008 Yes. So you probably said I did. Direct, I, like did I did. I did a like a pretty intense course where, you know, it's one of those things you you can't you can't do your laundry. You can't you can't brush your hair because it's like it's like boom boom smack smack. You know, <laughs> and a lot of people dropped out because it was pretty intense. Oh. You know, so they're cramming essentially two years or whatever into one, and you know every day you were doing something. So yeah. Okay, so you probably started directing like two thousand nine ten eight. 2008 yeah so from 2008 till now yes. how's Johnny been so far it's been great I, I'm learning a lot you know I've been I'm humble that people actually give me things to <laughs> to do for them you know I and it's, and it's just great and I'm describing more about myself I'm opening other parts of my brain the creative sides of my brain and then I wake up every day and I get to do what I want to do so you cannot knock that at all you know, I, I'm living my dream essentially every day. Okay. All right. So I still have Kemia Ditsuba here with me. And the, music, um, the phone line is still actually open. And the number still comes up and, you know, comes up on your screen and all that. But hello. Hello. Good afternoon. How are you doing? Hello. All right. I will include that if you want to call me, please try to turn on the TV set so that we can, you know, hear ourselves. Probably. Yeah, yeah. I've done already. I can hear you. So how are you? I'm fine, thank you. How are you doing today? Yeah, my name is Odofina Nismai. Okay, I didn't get your name. Odofina Olani Nismai. Oh, you have yeah. a very wonderful name. <laughs> how are you doing thank today? You. You're welcome. You have any questions I for Kemi? Yeah. Please okay. go ahead. Hello, K. 
Kenny. Hi, Nee. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? I'm awesome. Yeah, I just know you so much. I don't know you're into video call director. I'm into video directing. He didn't know you were into oh, video Oh, he, he did not know? Yeah. Well, it's always yeah. a good day to learn something. Yes, I am. <laughs> and I'm a, I'm a senior on a motor guinness stuff, so that's what I do. I thought, you know. Well, Tina, yes. <laughs> Yes, yes, Bye. I used to do that. I did that for four years. I hope you enjoyed it. Okay, um... Oh, we lost him. Yeah, oh. uh, we kind of... Okay, so Ni, you can call back if you want to. And then you, if you don't want to, you could just send an SMS for your questions. I'm sure she'll just answer the questions because she's still right here. Okay, so before your call came in, I was about to go on a musical break. So let's see Lagos party. Another <laughs> came out of the two and the walk. And then we'll be right back. <laughs> 